Good day, everybody. So today I shall update about the project at the solar system X that influence our Earth when it take at the core, at the magma laser, and even this on the surface of the Earth crust. Before that, please keep in mind that our Earth position is not the same as NASA's state. Because when I take the photo by myself at my house, in the morning, right, clean that digital image from NASA again, sunspot rotate from left to the right. But at the early morning, when they take the photo by Nikon P1000, it indicates that transport rotation is from bottom up. Let's say almost about 80 degrees different for the NASA image. Later on, when about before about at noon, so you to have to sit at at the angle, not left to right again. Remember that in the morning it's something like this. At noon, it bent to the left. So if you think about from this angle, it's about hundred and thirty five degree different from NASA image. The sun is so big, so huge. If we can comparison between the one sun is our Earth and the sun may be the as at the Himalaya mountain, something like that. So any point of Earth, look at the sun, the sun should be the same. But because our Earth not really orbit the sun as 
they show at all the image on the photo. And in the afternoon, afternoon it totally upside down right here from top to bottom, not from left to the right. So if you compare at the in form from the morning, it's about 270 degrees different from the anchor of the NASA. Why we see the sunspot like this from Earth? For, for me, only one explanation. Earth do not orbit the sun like this. Should be at the north. Okay. North point or lean to the sun. Why Earth orbit the sun? Earth rotate by cell and at the same time that orbit the sun too. So this explanation is being some electromagnetic or some gravity from below the earth and space have more influence okay, to make this earth lean like this. Therefore, this kind of uh, phenomena or we have a good explain that the planet system X that has the nemesis in the center and uh, Nibiru <coughs> in that <coughs> rotation, sorry. Not only the planet system X nemesis, Nibiru, Anunnaki, La, Tamiya, many things. There are not only one system X, many, at least three systems that come inside our solar system in Bao. Right now should be uh, between Jupiter and Ma and some cross between Ma and Earth. They have a lot of influence to our Earth. We have to check it there. Right here, you can see that they have a too high, okay, we can see too high energy. If we have only one sun, so the energy that point to the earth or drop to the earth should be only one, not two like this, sometimes three. It shows that the energy that hit earth comes from more than two sources of energy. Again and again, strong data, very strong uh, energy, strong proton at the back side of the Earth. The sun right here, right? The sun bro, the <coughs> solar wind bro from my side to this side. Look at the color. At the back, much more stronger, stronger than the front. Proton density, again, how could proton density at the back so that it indicates a lot of protons in the back of the Earth at night? Not only come from our sun, come from the other sun too. The pressure, how could Earth get the pressure out of the Earth, not from the front, not from the sun, and most of the pressure uh, at the back. Again, the pressure the energy not only come from the sun, can come from any direction. Allow the earth. Therefore, this indicate that they have another system, another star, or another planet that orbit close to the earth and the gravity that it's already the web have sent some strong frequency to earth magnetic field. Again take a look at triple laser, double laser 
and more of energy in the back, but up in the front. Right here at the arrow. The arrow point against the solar wind or the sun from our sun. So this one much more stronger. So they could okay, blow again our solar wind or solar storm. Again, IMF still straight right up front. Later on, it break off. Many things indicate that more energy, more proton, more pseudo proton come from the real or any side of the earth, not from the sun. The closer they are, the more strong influence will be. This will indicate at the north and the south. And again, in the south, electromagnetic, magnetic, I mean, or any, any word that you can say that, is split into more than four to five groups. It's not good. Last night, Earth in the south pole, so small, squeeze, so small. But right now, it's a little bit expanded size, longer. It does way normal. But the fact that no, up and down, up and down, see? expanding and descending. Right here, anomaly. Okay, this is be the normal standard deviation, but if an anomaly, it means sometimes the scientists could not expand what caused the problem. They say that anomaly, or maybe from dark matter, from dark energy. I believe they know what caused the problem, but they could not tell us the truth or truth. They have to keep something behind because they need to control the society, the economic society, and economic should not be corrupt before that event happened. Cause place they bombard Earth and today about at least three earthquakes at the Adamant Sea. Three times, not only one. Not good. And today, the web, okay, at boy five six zero zero one indicate that the water move from east to west. Look at the the web lens. Another boy five six zero zero three, the same. So the water move from east, totally from west to east. Look at the atmosphere over the North Pole. Mm. So many things indicate anomaly all around the world. This stay in the South Pole across North Sea. Look at the North. Pretty weak, right? Most of them move from Mongolia to Korea and Japan and to the Northern Pacific Ocean. Many people ask me that why we see the rainbow sky 
all around the world. Of course, because the Earth magnetic field in East Asia has been correct, and look for the the. Look at each picture, the cloud, the pumina, the color. It indicates that Earth magnetic field at east altitude has been correct, or be some leak, some hole on the other area. You can see that. So. You have to look at the sky at least four times a day, and you will realize that nothing the same. Many people try to warn us about incoming pollution. Not good at all. Nothing much today. By the way, we have to look by yourself. Okay, the figure, okay, the figure and the real situation is shown at this. Pollution could happen at any time, but before the pollution happen, how many days that we shall be like that when the pollution? Should happen. It's about sixty to fifty days, or winter around the world. Even the earthquake, the volcano, they are on the rock. They are not quiet. At the time, you have about sixty to fifty days to move yourself to the safe place, to underground shelter, or anywhere that you prepare for. Incoming event. In the last seven day, worst case scenario should be happen. Let's say about the the storm, the wind speed should be more than five hundred mile per hour. As I calculate, it should be about. Seven to eight hundred miles an hour. The power of the wind will blow any house, any building that not strong enough to the air. Earthquake, the dust from the volcanic activity all around the world. The heat from the spread, the heat from underground. So everything will happen at the same time. Pollution occur only one hour. After the pollution, we have to survive. We have to live through the apocalypse about at least two years. Two years, and it should take about another hundred years before the earth calm down. To be the same, not really the same, but calm down and peaceful. Let's say that peaceful and maybe it will look beautiful again after 100 years. And don't forget that we shall live in the period of written ice age all around the world. When the pollution happened, the geography of the earth. Of any country, will be changed their position, their location. Let's say my country 
should be close to either North Pole or South Pole, about 60 degrees to the north or 60 degrees to the south. What about your country? Think about that. More influence from the back. Look at the sky. Rainbow, crowd, rainbow sky. So many places around the world. It so it indicates that our Earth magnetic field in each layer at each altitude has been pretty weak more and more. We have to protect ourselves from the radiation from the space. This one, many people say that the north magnetic view reached a 40 degree mark. It doesn't mean at that day, hardship will happen. But this year, 2023rd, we will face the huge apocalypse. Eyes open, and we said, everyone, as Ben Diffin said, every morning, think about it. Prepare the food, water, and energy at least for two years. If possible, but do the best you can. Three months, six months, one year, it's up to your ability to do, that, to do that. But you have to prepare yourself and your family this year. Million of life should be gone. And the last wave of pandemic will happen all around the world. Should be within two months. To rise Keep your head down and God bless you. See you soon.